EA Sports are offering free live viewership rewards by watching their Twitch live stream and in this video I'm going to be talking to you about how to actually link your accounts, how to make sure they are linked and also talking about how the rewards can actually be won, how does it all work, do you have to be staying in the live stream just leaving it on for the whole day, what exactly all of this means. So just before we get into it, if you are new here, make sure that you do subscribe, we're going to make lots more videos just like this one, explaining lots of content and that is going to be coming to FIFA 20, showing you guys how exactly to do things and also when promos are going to be coming to FIFA, how to prepare for them, how to stay ahead of everyone else. So definitely make sure that you are subscribed so you do not miss any of those future videos. So getting straight into this one now, first of all, you do need to link your EA account and Twitch account together and you might have already done this because EA Sports do do these things quite often. So you can actually check by going to twitch.tv, go to your settings, and then go to connections and scroll down other connections you should actually have electronic arts as you can see I connected mine over a year ago if you do actually see this that means that you're all set up and you can just go and watch the live stream I'm going to talk about in just a second how all of the rewards actually work and how you can increase your chances maybe of actually winning them but if you don't actually see this you have to link your EA and Twitch account together so you can actually do that by first of all making sure you are logged into Twitch so so go to twitch.tv and if you are not signed in then it is actually going to take you to a login page and all you have to do is of course just sign into your Twitch account there and then after that once you have done that then just go to ea.com slash twitch linking this link will also be in the description and here all you need to do is just log into your EA account if you do have any problems with this you are going to have to contact EA because this is of course all of their database all of their account system some people do sometimes get a problem with this but most of you should be fine and then after that is actually going to make you enter a security code sent to your email again some people have some issues with this just make sure that you actually get the email correct and you are also checking your spam folder if it still doesn't come up and then you should actually find it and just put the security code in there just as easy as that and then after that is actually going to come up to confirm that you want to link these accounts together and if those are the correct accounts then you can just link them and it's really as easy as that you don't have to do anything else now when you you actually go and check your twitch connections electronic arts should now be there if it wasn't there already and now you are all just set up now you just need to go over to twitch and watch the ea live stream at twitch.tv slash ea sports fifa and make sure that you are doing it through twitch because if you are watching it somewhere else like youtube or something like that then the whole point of linking it is so that ea sports can actually find your account who's watching it and that's how they randomly kind of like choose the winner so make sure that you are definitely watching through twitch and there are quite a lot of frequently asked questions about this because EA Sports don't really say too much information they just say that there's like a free chance of you actually winning a huge reward which kind of like engages most people and brings them in but this is all free you don't actually need Twitch Prime some people are asking this is completely free it's just random drops that EA can choose a Twitch user in the stream watching and they know which account they actually need to give the rewards to and there are quite a lot of people asking how do you actually increase your chances do you need to watch the whole live stream can you just leave it on all day and we don't exactly know how EA Sports choose the winners but just regularly engaging in the stream not really spamming is the best thing in my opinion that can actually get you there I think it is just completely random when I did speak to some people actually asking how they actually won the main rewards because there were a few people on Twitter in the past some of them just said they just popped in the live stream for a few minutes 10-15 minutes and they actually won the main reward and some people were saying that they left it on the whole day on multiple devices different stuff like that but I think there's just if you actually just come in the stream maybe for an hour or two and you actually engage in the chat not spamming not saying things like GG there's so much of that going on if you guys do actually look at these live streams it doesn't actually increase your chances it's not proven to so I wouldn't really be doing that if anything it does actually decrease your chances I reckon the best thing is just to sit there just talk like engage a few things just say good goal if someone scores or try and like support whoever is playing something like that there is also sometimes a trivia if you engage in that it just shows that you are engaging and that will probably just boost your chances if that even exists and the rewards for you guys that are actually asking usually everyone is guaranteed a kit or a small pack something like that some people do get a better pack like a mega pack or 50k pack untradeable things like that and the most rare rewards that everyone is aiming for that EA Sports lures everyone in with is actually they offer like icons now today is actually icon Thierry Henry when I'm making this video 
video. Also, Team of the Year, De Jong, and other cards, they do, of course, rotate these whenever they are doing live events like these. But very few people get these. I do think it's an extremely small amount. Esports don't officially say how many, but I definitely think it's something like under 50 or something like that. And seeing that there is actually usually 50,000 people watching live stream, things like that, that's actually a very small amount of people that do get that. But best of luck for you guys that are trying this. Comment down below if you guys do need any other help, and I'll try to reply to all of you guys down there. Thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.